Oh guys, I just made a terrible discovery. This, do not buy these. Whatever you do, do not buy these. So I just spent the last few hours finishing up repairing these battery packs. And as a victory lap, my friend brought, the, brought me these batteries and he said, you know, these, these stop working after a little while and you're pretty good with batteries. Here's a little project for you. And I opened it up and I realized there's no wires going to most of these leads. And I looked at the BMS and this is more of a thing to fake a BMS. This is a fake BMS. I measured the voltages and the voltages are all different. Now, unfortunately, this fluke meter can only read individual volts. It can't read millivolts. And a lot of these read either four volts or zero, or zero volts. <laughs> four volts, I mean, there's a good chance it's over 4.2 volts. And the other one's zero volts. Well, there's zero volts. So I'm kind of afraid to have these in the building now, especially since I can't actually tell what voltages they really are. They could be 4.5 volts, they could be 4.6 volts. And it seems that you know, these have absolutely no balancing whatsoever. This is terrifying. There's a connection, there's a connection here, then it snakes all the way through, and then the only other connections it has is this and this. And it seems that it actually measures the battery power off of just these two uh, parallel cells right here. And so these are the first to go. These ones are dead on this one and dead on this one. This one, these three rows are dead and these, these ones are really charged. Oh, th this, this terrifies me. This really terrifies me because I opened up all three packs and they all have this fake BMS that isn't connected to anything. It only has three out of the one, two, three, four, five, six leads connected. This is dangerous. This is really dangerous. I, I wish I had my good camera with me because I would film a legit video about it. But my little smartphone that I carry around will have to do. Oh, it, it, this bothers me so much. I'm gonna now. I'm gonna have to take these home. I'm gonna have to test the voltage. I'm gonna have to run them down if they're like 4.5 volts. If they went to 4.5 volts, I don't know if I can really trust them. Half of them are bad. I can't believe they're making these packs without BMSs. They're literally fake BMSs, just meant to trick it. Yeah, this is a bit of a, it's, I mean, it's almost a little bit of a day ruiner because you just think about how these are not being regulated at all, voltage wise, and they're just sitting here. And we probably have a bunch more in this building and I didn't even know. Okay, I'm gonna, we just, we, we won't be getting these anymore unless we plan to add a BMS to them. Cause this is, this is scary. I thought those were scary, but at least those actually take an effort to monitor the cells. These ones, though. Lithium-ion batteries without a BMS. Whew. 